Good evening, everyone. Welcome to my channel. So today, I have another activities in challenges that the teacher provides to do is poem reading. So I have choose one poem by John Masfield. The title is Sea Fever. So then waste the time. We'll read it together. I must go down to the seas again. To the lonely sea and the sky, and all I ask is a tall ship and a stars to steer her by, and the whale kick and the wind's songs and the white sail shaking, and a gray mist on the sea's crest and a gray dawn breaking. I must go down. To the seas again, for the call of the running tide. It's a white call and a clear call that may not be denied. And all I ask is a windy day, with the white clouds flying, and the flying spray, and the brown stream, and the sea's gulls crying. I must go down to the seas again, to the wayground gypsy life, to the gulls' waves and the walls' waves, where the winds like a wetted knife. And all I ask is the merry jaunt from a laughing fellow rover and a quiet sleep. And a sweet dream, when the long trick's over. After reading this poem, I also feel that I was with the writers on the ship, surrounded by the seas, have a wind, deep fog, surrounding, feel a bit, a little bit cool. And also, I could hear the sound of the sea gull, that crying around and flying. So the vivid imagery poem is the kind of poem that the writer describes everything that he could see with our own sense. Encourage everyone to find the poem and start to read. And share about your feeling when you read it. Thank you for watching, and I also uh, want to say apologize for my pronunciation because it's not really good like a, a native speaker. Thank for your favor, and thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.